along those terms, I want to go back to Tina Turner mm-hmm. because she's selling her entire song catalog for an estimated 50 million to BMG. This includes her name, her likeness, image, and music. Now to me, this is a genius move for both sides. She's been out of the game for several years. I, I can't see her making a comeback again or putting out an album again. She probably wants to live the quiet life somewhere. Now she's got an extra 50 million to do so. She can ride off into the sunset with that. While BMG, they can use her music in soundtracks, commercials, uh, documentaries. They can re-release her entire catalog if they want to now. And they can make that money back in CDs and streaming. So I think this is a win for both sides right here. I didn't like it when I first saw it. Well, first I thought she was already dead. So it was good to see she was still around. I, I thought she did, you know, Thought uh, she had fought the good fight and died in Australia or some shit or whatever. And she gave her U.S. citizenship. Um, I only am okay with it because she's old as shit. So it's like you said, she ain't about to do nothing else. Unless they go will her out like Isaac Hayes before he died, she ain't about to do shit. She, ain't, she can't dance no more. She probably stomped hard and her ankle to break. So it made sense for her to do this deal. I just personally think that she undersold herself, her name, her likeness. 50 mil is a drop in the fucking bucket. When you got motherfuckers like the Dream, who sold his catalog for like 40 mil. And the Dream's not an icon like King of Turner. Yeah, he's a hit make writer, producer, and got some hit songs of his own. But King of Turner, the Dream. Catalogs sell for the the same, that makes no sense. So just BMG literally did a smashing grab on her old ass and she probably old and sing now don't have the right people around her and all they seeing is, you go die soon, we go be rich. And I get it, 50 million ain't worried about your lifestyle no more but it wasn't a good business move how it was done. Easily 25 mil got left on the tape. You can't tell me Tina Turner couldn't go to somebody and say, my catalog, 75 is what I'm listening. Lowest I'll take is 65. You can't tell me somebody wouldn't give that to her. Just off the damn movie alone, she could get about 10, 15. So it just, again, niggas not knowing they were, not having a good, good jewel around to make sure they get the best money they can get. And she left money on the table. Yeah, I said it.